A major milestone today at the West Palm Beach VA, all in the effort to connect veterans with quality health care. WPTV News Channel 5's Lenny Supal takes us inside a new facility at the VA Medical Center in West Palm Beach. Good evening. This facility is the first of its kind in South Florida, and tonight as we take you inside, we'll explain why doctors, pharmacists, and other veterans say that it's opening at a critical time. A ribbon cutting and a new day for local veterans. After years of planning and construction, the West Palm Beach VA Medical Center is celebrating a major milestone. Each veteran has their own story, their own experiences, and their own needs and goals. We want this to really feel like a home for them. The new residential treatment facility has a focus on mental health. So we'll come down here to the bariatric room. Dr. Molly Leach took us on a tour. She's the mental health clinical pharmacy specialist on site and is committed to the center's approach. Their success is one of the best things. It's like, you know, watching watching a child graduate. It's the it's the same feeling to, to be reintegrated into the community. According to the Department of Veterans Affairs, on average, 20 veterans die by suicide each day. Congressman Brian Mass says it's an issue that needs Washington's attention. Making sure that we're addressing wait times, making sure that the infrastructure within the VA facilities is, uh, is not just uh, suitable, but hopefully exceeds any other medical location out there across the state. As a veteran who receives care at the VA, Maria Victoria Charles says the location of this new facility is ideal. And I see it as a beacon of hope. In addition to addressing mental health needs, this facility also has a goal of tackling substance abuse and homelessness within the veteran community. Reporting from Palm Beach County, Lenny Sue Paul, WPTV News Channel 5.